Attention to that red dot. That's us. Kawabongu. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Buddy Plays. I'm Buddy, and this is a... I don't even know how to pronounce this word. Uh, Paradigm? 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 This is a game that I found on Steam a long time ago. Uh, I also know Jacksepticeye has played it, but I've never seen this game. Um, I've just seen of it. Uh, and I wanted to try it today. Uh, this might be a serious game, I think. Uh, it could be fun. It could also be a one-off. We're just gonna play it. We're gonna see what's up. Oh god, how did I- how, how did this open? I just wanted to play Solitaire. I have no idea what it, what an adventure game even is. Part of the experienced adventure game? Oh god. <laughs> okay, uh, medium. Adventure games. Okay. I don't know, you've played a few point-and-click adventure games. Three-headed monkeys and puny deaths, or sometimes you hold deer. Besides, who needs stupid words help, uh, helping you do stuff? Hint systems are for plebs. Dawn. I guess that's what this is. Are you echoing? This is an archived information, uh, informational. Oh. Dupa genetics. <laughs> Who's this guy? Is your child yes. a failure? Have they wasted years of their life acquiring an <laughs> art degree? Do you make it rain on a regular basis? Only to spend it on your child's expensive taste in bullshit coffee? Is your child just an asshole? My life. These are questions we ask every day. Here at Dupa Genetics, we What's your solution, solution. Dupa? Give them jobs? Prodigy Child, the fully customizable child of your dreams. The process is very simple. We gather <laughs> your broken dreams, we combine it with our cutting edge genetic sequencing technology, and finally, our secret sauce. Is that the same as the Powerpuff Girls? Your Prodigy Child. Broken dreams, genetic sequences, and secret sauce. These were the ingredients to create the perfect prodigy children until the professor accidentally added too much dank memes. And thus, Paradigm was born. It was too. Buy a prodigy child today. You won't regret it. Time to put on some beatsies. <laughs> Okay. You gotta put something more upbeat, my dude. Ugh, I am so bored. I should probably make progress on my EP and make some beats on the computer. And not procrastinate, which would inevitably lead me to reevaluating my life decisions and sleeping silently. <laughs> That's great. I've completely forgotten how to exist. <laughs> Uh, Paradigm, have you forgotten how to function as a mutant human being? Again, would you like a tutorial? Yeah, sure. Give me yes. a tutorial. I feel like this is something I shouldn't forget. Thank God you exist. I could never afford the real doctor. Would you like a regular tutorial or a like action dog tutorial? What's a dog tutorial? Definitely dog tutorial. Definitely dog tutorial. How to play Paradigm. That is a dog. Hello, dog. <laughs> Hello, uh, I'm, Hello. I am a talking tumor. Uh, I will be your guide. Oh, that's the thing on the side of his head. How did I make that screen come up? Uh, yes. Hmm. Just like the fashion combo of socks, sandals, and fanny bags, whose jokes only consist of puns. Oh, I'm not supposed to click. Okay, I know that now. Oh, bye! Hmm. I don't feel like playing solitaire right now. <laughs> What's my record collection do? Use. Get rich or die of natural causes. <laughs> <coughs> uh. 
babe, I love you, but I'm a T-Rex. <laughs> uh, Sheen, sensual steam, a guide to computership, the future lover, set smooth the jets, online dating, text, oh, fuck. texting, emoticons, friend zones, Pluto, if only I was still a planet. If you were a square, I'd be, I'd love all four sides of you. That's great. Um, can I... The record is missing from its slip. Oh no, S speak again. The record is missing from its slip. Damn it, you hustling dog. How can I stay mad at you? You're so cute and fluffy. What about this one? This could get John in the mood. This could get John in the mood. This could get John oh, okay, in the mood. He doesn't really have any dialogue for this stuff. So. Okay, well, I also noticed that this plug is out, so let's uh, pick up this cable. I need some sort of. I have first. adapter. Uh, inventory. We, we, we're gonna put that in here. Yay! <gasps> Turbo! It worked. Whoa, Mike, what do you unplug me for? You know why. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is John. Why isn't the computer booting? I want to make some fat ass beatsies. Mike, with some of the filth I'll say in your internet history, I'm not surprised. Makes me kind of worried if I want to be a part of this world. Then I'll think about all the shielders that would be gutted, and then I change my mind. All the shielders that would be gutted? Wouldn't it be unfortunate if I just tripped and unplugged you again? Don't worry, mate. I'm not judging you. It's a little bit messed up, but uh. It's perfectly normal for sick blokes such as yourself, anyway. Alright. Real talk, why isn't it working? Mate, the operating system is bugged. Some uh, bloody hacker bloke mess with your system files. You're gonna need to warp it and reinstall it using the recovery floppy disk. Can't I just turn it on and off again? When did you learn advanced IT support? <laughs> I'm impressed. Top, Top bloke. bloke. Congratulations. True blue. Amazing. Top wazza. Alright, I get it. I like the Australian accent, and then I like his, like, basic foreign accent. Where can I find the recovery floppy disk? Alright, I'll search with my little Google here, and check it Are out. Are they allowed That's to use Google? It only tells me oh, that was a, a copyrighted thing. Area, and one little weird secret to get ripped. I always wondered what I'd look like with a six-pack. Just tell me where to get it. Alright, mate, I'll tell ya. But first I need your help. I've got at least 10 chat rooms and two internet dating sites to frequent tonight, and I need you to get me in the zone. How am I supposed to do that? I'm a little bit hurt you don't remember anymore. Ever since I had to roll back to version 2.1, you can't even look in my eyes, Jordan. We've already discussed this. You don't even have eyes. Seriously, what do you want? Use your imagination, mate. I need to maximize my sex appeal potential. One ton of copper wiring doesn't exactly swoon potential partners. Except for Sweaty Salvage Men. And I'll tell you what, mate, I don't want any news from Sweaty Salvage Men tonight unless they look like sexy, sweaty ladies. Figure something out. Gross. Gross. Ugh. Such an irritating minor inconvenience. I just want to finish my new MP. <laughs> By the way, if you don't fix the computer soon, the power plant will melt down and everyone will be dead. Or become seriously maimed, living their life in constant agony. Cheers, mate. There must be something in this room I can give him. Something I can give him. He runs on records. Why? You know your tunes, Paradigm. Gonna slay so many circuits tonight. Anyway, you can find the floppy disk from a fellow named Space Cadet. That local drug addict guy. Ask Doug outside for some directory dues if you can't remember. Directions? That's what I said. Well, I have to go save the world, I guess. By the tone of your voice. Clearly don't understand the gravity of the situation. <laughs> uh, yeah, I understand. We need floppy disks. Uh, thought bodies and have wacky events or experience this life from each other's. Ha 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 ha, you have no idea, dude. Hey, do you ever think about what we would like to communicate by touching butts together? Yeah, I understand. We need the floppy to swap bodies and have wacky adventures experiencing life from each other's perspective. Yeah, nah. I figured you wouldn't understand, so I prepared this pipe and mash on Earth for your benefit earlier. Wow, 
You've really improved on your paper mache craft skills. Great work, John. Cheers, mate. I really appreciate your support of my hobby. <laughs> yes. Anyway, you say, Cobza, all the world's radioactive waste is stored under the crush. There is enough radioactive waste under this station for complete annihilation. As you probably know, Krush is world number one in the Brahmin okay. economy. Now, pay attention to that I red am. dot. That's us. Cowabungo. Cowabungo. <laughs> That's the basic gist of the Sizzo. <laughs> I like this 90s aesthetic, or a, I guess 70s aesthetic. But like... People died in agony. Pine. Suffering. And not spur long screaming. Oh, so my humans have like uh, two years to extend when this goes down. Oh, right. I should probably stop probably. that. Piper Mache seems to always reject you, Paradigm. Paradigm. You should start okay, selling these that. online. They're really great. Yeah, nah, 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 yeah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah. One day. <laughs> but yeah, go see Doug up Thor for some direct reduce to Space Kidders Plus. Ah, uh, sorry for not talking a lot. They're just like... Okay, let's uh... I used to let the hobo crash in there. I didn't check on him for a while. I soon found out he likes smearing things on walls. I don't go in there anymore. Warning. Imminent complete meltdown is imminent. Yeah, I like it when you talk to me dirty, safety, I, I. <laughs>